this was the second time round for us. We, was, we did it last year for the first time, which was really incredible and life-changing for, um, for our marriage. After, after this lamb, I can really say, um, I want specifically with the conflict handling and where we learn when you're in that moment, the heat of the moment, and you are so upset and angry, breathe, ask Holy Spirit, how can we handle this? What is, which is the right way that we learned? And I think something else, which was kind of just through the whole experience and not from, from the actual book, was to remind myself who is first. Um, my wife is, is the most important priority I have on earth. Uh, in fr- uh, before my kids, before ministry, before work and all these things. After Lamb, I feel so much more connected. I didn't think that we had like serious issues, um, but I had no idea what marriage really can feel like and what the Lord intended it to be. So I feel um, I, was, I was really able to give myself more wholeheartedly. A marriage is like a car. You don't wait until it breaks down and then service it. Like um, It needs to be serviced. After the first couple of weeks a lamb, we were first forced to have, I wouldn't say forced, but we, we had conversations that we were putting off um, for a long time, which, which caused a lot of underlying tension um, in our marriage. and. You know, those subtle jabs that come out in, in times of conflict that are so unnecessary and it's all rooted in something that you haven't worked through um, or, you know, there's a stronghold. And so within the first couple of weeks, we, we kind of resolved the massive conflict and I was like, okay, we, we can finish the course now. This is amazing. You know, the first couple of weeks were, were really good. Um, everything else seemed to be a bonus.